Hi everyone, this is me, Moonlight Guidance. We are doing a reading today and this is a very safe space where you are always very welcome. Um, and this is for all star signs. So if you are here, I really feel like there are messages for you. And I also wanted to mention as well that if you wanted to win a free reading with me, check out the description box below as I do giveaways every single month. Also, if you wanted to purchase any personal services, check out the... Um, website as well shopmoonlightguidance.com which is linked down below as well for personal tarot readings there's also rituals to manifest different areas of your life there's black magic energy removal protection ritual and rituals for various areas of your life for love money success marriage healing and so much more and at the bottom of my website there are thousands of five star reviews on the intention items as well which are handmade items that are meditated with and sage so those are super special and do check them out if you wanted to and everything is literally there for your convenience. Um, so yeah, you know, those bracelets, necklaces, anklets, pom-poms, sage bundles, candles, teas, etc. Okay, so check that out if you're interested and we will begin. All right, let's begin. See what's coming through, all right? Okay, let's see. I also wanted to use um, this Oracle deck that I I'm staring at. <laughs> also, I'll get some cards from there as well. I just really, I feel very drawn to it today for this reading. It was just, it was looking at me. I mean, I was looking at it too, but it was looking at me. Okay. Ooh. You know what? I was actually going to say, um, I was actually going to point out the Wheel of Fortune because it was literally just sitting right there. And then we literally got the card here, which also says Wheel on it. I should have done that. I should have. But, you know, I wanted to just get all the cards out. But what I will say here is that that's quite a synchronicity. We'll explain that in a little bit. There may be some other synchronicities here as well. So let me just turn all the cards over. some interesting things to tell you okay I really I really do so I hope you will give me a second just to do this because I know you've got things to do in the day as well okay I know that you've got other things going on so I appreciate you waiting on me whilst I get this done okay there's another synchronicity here especially with crown we've got uh, three cards where there are three people wearing crowns in the reading okay so what I really want to say and what I feel is so important that you need to know is the fact that there is a lot of success that is going to come your way it probably sounds I mean it's huge right but it probably sounds like oh okay is that the most important thing I need to know okay thanks Mula. I'm gonna be successful wonderful no, really, it is going to happen. And I know that a lot of you do doubt yourself, especially with the sun and the moon, because one minute, you know, you feel like, yes, I've got that motivation. I'm going to be successful. It's going to be amazing. I'm going to work hard. And then the next second, you start to doubt yourself because perhaps things don't go, you know, things don't go correctly. Things don't go right. And then you start to feel like, is it really going to happen? I'm not really sure. Is it going to? Do not doubt it. Okay. It will happen. It's normal, to be honest, to doubt things, but try not to um, let that then affect the actions that you put in towards the things, right? Because it's really important that you keep going um, because even here with this ship card as well, do not give up, okay? Do not give up in terms of work and career. One thing I will tell you is that things in your like relationship life can very, very easily impact your career. And what I mean by that is it's just so, so important that if you are having difficulties in your personal relationships, that you try not to let it affect your career. Now, how can you try and separate personal and professional? Well, it's really, really important because if you feel low in your energetic level because something is not going right in your relationship, it can translate into the professional area and that is not something you want because that can then slow down the success that you are supposed to have. I also feel that you will have so much success that it will give you like a healthy sense of pride. Um, so that's something that I do see here. Obviously too much pride is not good, but there is a healthy sense of pride where sometimes you've just felt so invalidated, you haven't felt so great, but now you will start to feel confident. You will start to feel like, yes, I've got this. Many of you are going to start your own business from what I see here. If you already have your own business, it's something that's going to get stronger. So I really see you having something of your own, okay? Keep working 
working towards your goals and your dreams, try to put one foot in front of the other. If you come across um, difficulties with your emotions or people around you treating you not that great, try, try, try to separate the personal and the professional and try not to let that get in the way of the success that is naturally going to come your way because I do feel like there can be, you know, some jealous friends or some of you may have issues in your relationships and that can very, very easily emotionally tamper with you know the direction that you're trying to go in towards this success and it can really slow down elements of success and you obviously don't really want that to happen let's be honest right so what i will say is keep going but also be very careful of the kinds of people that you have around you in your life the people that take away in, um you know your anxiety not so the people that build in you anxiety, the people that create in you tension, the people in you that create stress and frustration and make you always feel like it's your fault, these are not your people. These are not your people, okay? Because what do they do? They lower your vibrational energy, they take away your energy, then you suddenly don't have enough energy for work, you don't have energy to, you know, really do all of those things that are actually supposed to bring you success, that are supposed to really build in a lot of success and stability in your life, and it actually blocks your blessing. Be very careful of the kinds of people that you keep around you in your life because you are destined for success. You are destined for a lot of money. But there are people that will come in and create this kind of chaos. It will make you feel frustrated. It will lower your vibrational energy. And then you will feel like, but why am I not as successful as, I, as I'm working hard to be? And that is because these people are taking away your energy. Make sure you protect yourself. Very, very important because you are destined for some really big things financially. You, are, you will be so independently financially Financially successful and stable. I got there in the end. I, I did say it in sort of one sentence um, that you will have so much, so much, so much abundance, but you will be like really independently strong within yourself. And then areas of like love will really start to kick into gear. It's in your destiny that your finances will become more stable first, okay? And then love will become more stable. That's what I'm seeing here. Your journey and your direction in your life right now is first and foremost towards areas of money, stability, career. Once that becomes quite settled and stable, comes really this beautiful energy here, okay, of beginnings in terms of finances, beginnings in terms of more success, beginnings in terms of more abundance, more joy. Um, I also see here as well, we've got snake, which is desire and attraction. Okay, so you will start to have more attraction towards, um, well, you'll be very attractive towards a person here, okay, and, and things will start to then come together. So first and foremost, work starts to become more stable. You will become so confident within yourself that you, you are so happy within yourself and your independent self, and then love starts to progress because we've got here Peacock, which shows pregnancy and wealth. So this is, you know, the birth of like something new, but also does showcase that yes, it can also symbolize the birth of children in time, but it's also going to be the birth of like relationships and bigger and better things. But first and foremost, it is going to be the seeds that you've planted in regards to your career becoming more stable and then a lot of this coming together. But yes, I do see that there can be family later down the line. So, you know, your wishes and dreams will come true, but there is an order to it that I'm picking up on. First and foremost, you will have success, okay? You will be so confident independently with the work that you are doing and then that in time really allows you to have the kind of love and happiness that you want. Love and happiness is on the cards, but it seems to come after you are so like stable and wealthy in your own energy. Like you can stand on your own two, two feet and feel so stable financially, emotionally, mentally, physically, and then love comes into your life because that's when you will then be completely ready for this kind of new love. And that is really what is being worked towards at this very point in time. So I really hope that helped. Yeah, I really hope this reading helped in some way, shape or form. But say to yourself, I am wealthy and I am healthy. That is the affirmation for your reading. Okay, comment it down below if this resonated with you. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe as well if you haven't already. Check out the description box below for information on personal services, for reading giveaway, intention items, and all that good stuff. And I will see you all very, very soon. So definitely do check out, you know, all the info at some point down below and yeah i'll see you all very soon don't forget to subscribe as well um i post short 
readings and long readings every single day and I will see you all very very soon bye